Margaret Mary Alcock was born in the year of our Lord, 1647, in Burgundy, France. At the age of 24, she entered the convent of the Sisters of the Visitation at Perret le monial France, in 1671. It was common for Margaret Mary to add prayers during the night, especially on Holy Thursday and Friday. The other sisters had, at times, seen the saint remain immobile on her knees for as long as 12 hours, as she prayed before the tabernacle or blessed sacrament. Three to four times the sisters reported that it was necessary to carry Margaret Mary away, exhausted by assaults of love that were so intense that no human could bear them. Once being before the blessed sacrament, and having a little more leisure than usual, I felt wholly filled with his divine presence, and so powerfully moved by it that I forgot myself in the place in which I was. I abandoned myself to his divine spirit and yielded my heart to the power of his love. The sacred heart he showed me as a sun brilliant with sparkling light whose burning rays fall direct on my heart. I then feel myself inflamed with such a fire that it seems about to reduce me to ashes. This is much more painful to me than all I suffered in my passion. If men rendered me some return of love, I should esteem little of all I have done for them, and should wish, if such could be, to suffer it over again. But they meet my eager love with coldness and rebuffs. Jesus reveals to Margaret Mary that the devotion to the Sacred Heart would be an amende honorable, in addition to being a way in which all souls could expiate all the crimes of the world and console Jesus' forsaken heart. She confided to Father de la Colombière the details of this third revelation. Having attentively studied the written account of the Sacred Heart revelations and being inspired from on high, he assured Margaret Mary that the revelations were from heaven.